Hello, my lovely trilobites and fossil fam. We are starting the declutter because it has it has to be done. It does. I it, it's it's reached a point where it's making me twitchy and my OCD unhappy. So it ha it has to be done. So we're doing concealers, foundations, pressed powders, and then loose powders. So yes. And right off the bat, um, this one's almost done, so I'm just gonna finish it up. I mean, there's there's like barely any in here, and I really actually like this. It is light enough for me, and it's almost done. So I am gonna keep that one and just finish it up. This Dior one is almost also done, so I'm just gonna finish this up as well. At first I didn't like this, then I liked it, then I didn't like it anymore. It has like a sweet spot, okay? And like not right when you open it, but then like not towards the end. There's like the middle part where it's like amazing and then nah, it's kind of gone past there. And then this one I have been using a little bit. This, this one's about like two thirds. So those are the three. And then I found this one, which I didn't know was open. And um, considering it's like Spider-Man, I'm very, very frightened. Okay, yes, yeah, see that that's 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 not normal. But <laughs> what do we have here? A random petri dish. Nyerk. Let's see what's in there. And this is this is getting thrown out. Maybe I should do another dot. Like I feel like I didn't Okay, yeah. Let's let's see what grows in there. But this is getting thrown out because um, there hasn't been a Spider-Man movie in a long time. And that's got that's got to go. And these I have not opened yet. These are like my concealer backups for when those three kick the bucket because two of those are almost about to. So these are these are my like concealer backups. So they're not opened. So I will keep those as well. Oh, oh, this is this this is gonna be special. I was trying to check the expiry dates. I don't even... Oh no, that does not smell right. I don't even... No, 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 no. That's, that's not good. Petri dish, where are you? Where are you, Petri dish? There we go. Yes, I washed my hands before this, but I mean, it's my makeup, so it's my... This is... This is not good. <laughs> that's that's not good. No, no, we're no, we're getting rid of that. Okay. Oh, that's an eco. Oh, that's an ecosystem. Ooh, that'd be fun to take apart and see what's growing in there. I didn't know that was in there. That's actually frightening. I really hope I'm not on camera. Okay. Uh, do 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 do. This is me with a tan, so in the winter, but this texture is like patchy and no, I have really dry skin, so this isn't going to work. This is way too, way, way too dry for me. Way too, this is way too dry for me. If you have oily skin, this might be amazing, but for dry skin and like mature skin, no, this is this is not gonna do it. This, however, oh, <laughs> oh yes, that's just gonna go over there by the picture. Like I'll soak that and and do other things with it. Ooh, so excited! We found a really disgusting sponge that I can experiment on. So total bonus. Um, these Clinique ones I had before I even started YouTube. Um, and uh. They're not, they're, they're, I don't even, I don't even really want to open this. I am sure these are expired by now. But for the sake of science, can we even get anything out of here? Oh, that's fine. I have lots of Petri dishes. Oh, God. No, that's, that's, that's not right. That's, that's not right. Oh, this one, like. Oh, good God. Okay. Yeah. 
yeah don't worry it, it, it'll be better oh god that's disgusting okay um this one i also believe expired i did get it like at tj maxx or 399 i did wear quite a bit of it but oh that's not good i tend to find one and then like stick with it oh okay ew 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 oh it's chunky oh it's chunky and that's not that's not i i don't i don't want chunks in my makeup i did like it though but don't worry i'll fix that okay yeah this one's this one's past its life i did like it though prior to it expiring i really did and um it wasn't bad i mean for 3.99 i mean mine expired and it's it's completely dead but i did like it and for four bucks like that's not a bad deal but oh that's in the trash can should i be keeping count i'm just chucking things in the bin and i'm like not keeping track um that's fine i'll do it in editing okay so <laughs> I really do like this, but this can oxidize on me really bad. I have to use like a like a very specific primer with it and a very specific like powder and setting spray combo or else I turn orange. So this one's, I mean, I use it and I think it's about half gone actually, but it is finicky. It This does oxidize on me more than I would prefer. So, I mean, I'm going to keep it for now because it's like really expensive but I want to try to use it up because I need to. Oh, my hourglass stick. Oh my God, this thing's almost gone. Like, <laughs> it's almost gone. Do you see that? It's, it's, there's like barely anything. I love this thing so much. I have dry skin and I guess mature skin. And for some reason, they, like, um, it has to like warm up to my skin tone and then it like melts in. And then it's just gorgeous. But you have to let it like warm up a bit and like melt in if you have dry skin. And like I started doing it with a brush and then I switched to a sponge and then I started with like doing it with my fingers. And with my fingers, it like just melts in beautifully. Like it melts in better. So I love this formula. I will probably repurchase one of these next year. This one I will finish up in the meantime. This is like my my summer shade, which is pretty much the lightest shade. Whatever shade, you're, it's the lightest one. Let's put it that way. Oh, I I lied. This is shade two. Cool, because I am I have a cool undertone. So I do want to keep those. This is questionable. This has been around since before my channel. Oh, no. Is this gloppy? Ooh. Is this full of air? Okay, if it's full of air, it might be full of bacteria. Did I even use this? Did I? This is in the shade like marshmallow. This is really, really thick. Okay, mental note, don't use that much. Uh, This one actually doesn't really smell that bad. I'm not even sure if I ever even used this. It's in the shade Marshmallow, and I think I'm gonna keep it around. I mean, it is a really, really thick formula, but there are times where I do want like full coverage. Not often, but it does happen. And I, I would like to keep like a full coverage one around, like just for that like purpose. Okay, now we're like all over the place here. Okay, uh, this Tarte Tape Shape, oh my gosh, this is pre-YouTube as well. And I, I did. I made a really, really good dent in this sucker. Where is the expiration date? This is in 16 Neutral Light Fair. Fair Light Neutral? What the pops tarts? Oh my gosh. I think I got this. When I was visiting my parents in Florida, because they were like retired, they live on the beach. I think I got this at the Ulta 
in Florida pre-Panini. Okay, like that is how this should not be, um, this, this should not, not be, uh, this, this should, yeah, I don't, I don't know about this. I really did like this and I used the heck out of it. So I just think this one's just really old and expired. It smells kind of like flower perfume and I don't, remember it smelling like that initially so that one's that one's gonna go far away from me because the smell of flowers will give me a massive massive headache like the gucci blush i bought one of the gucci blushes i brought it home i opened it and my entire room smelled like roses and i was like nope shut the lid put it back in the box and returned it and my car smelled like roses for like a week and it was horrible I, I just, no, it was horrible. This one I just got, and I, this is pretty much going to replace the hourglass when I finish the hourglass, because this one's lighter than the hourglass, so, like, this will be my, um, winter one, because I am that pale in the winter, and so this is kind of, like, my backup stick to the hourglass, which is why this is here. So that is not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm going to have a big empties bin soon, actually. This one is also from a long time ago. Ooh. This is like the Born This Way in the shade Snow. We have Marshmallow, we have Snow, we have Porcelain, we have Alabaster, whatever. Like, I, I just refer to myself as translucent jellyfish, but here we are. And now my hand's kind of red because I've like been doing, what in the, what did, is this really liquidy? Oh, this is yellow. I am not yellow. I am not yellow. That is not my color at all under any circumstances. That is not my color. That's, I can't wear that. That's not my color. That's too dark. Um, I really do like the Estee Lauder double wear in one cool one. This one I do really like. It wears really good if I need to like wear it to work all day long. But I know I'm going to have lab goggles on, so I'm going to have to, like, touch it up and whatnot. Like, this is the one I'll wear for, like, a really long day at work because I like my hourglass too much to do lab goggles to it, and then I'll feel bad. So this one I do wear. It's kind of, like, in the pile. Um, this one's still in the box because that, that's, that's another problem. And this one I haven't opened. <laughs> that's another kind of problem, but this is one one fair. But this one's really light. I really do like a light coverage skin tint. And I know that's why I bought that. And then I just started using concealer instead. Because it was easier. This one I got on Amazon Prime Day. This one is so pale. And I forgot I bought it. And it's already opened. Yikes. Okay. Um, but this one, this one's really, really full coverage. But it's more my color. It matches me really, really well. And this one I don't... I don't know. I'm going to have to like, I'm going to have to kind of test these side by side and see which one I want to keep. Like this one's newer, but this, but it's also really, really thick. So, but I do have like a thinner, these thinner ones over here. So, okay. Like we're, I'm looking at like, I think we're half and half. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, my camo CC cream. Yes. Summertime. We're good. As long as the SPF lasts. This expires 12-2024, so we are good. I can use this next summer. It is fine. And God, I really like this stupid thing, okay? I don't know why, but I really like this formula. I do. It's weird, but I like it. And I just locked it. That's great. That, oh, that that's not that's not a good sign. Oh God, that's really thick too. Okay, ew, ew, ew. Okay, this one's also kind of old. This was, this is like over a year old. So I think I got this like last year in like February and I got it on sale. It's really thick, but I already have a really thick one that I like. So I kind of need to, yeah, we need to get rid of that one. That's, that's just creepy. Okay. 
I only own three pressed powders. Uh, there are a few in like two face palettes, but um, this one is gonna be dead soon. This is like my favorite and this is my favorite for like under eye. It's just the plain white one. And this one I'm using because I have it and I feel like I should use it up. So these are my three, I only have three pressed powders. So I'm just gonna keep all of them and use them up. Okay, on to face powders. I'm still testing the Moira and Givenchy, but I actually do really like them. This one is more finely milled, but it's really scented. This one is unscented, but not as finely milled. But it's, they're, I'm, I still like both of them. And they're relatively new. This one, I, I love the formula, but the color is not for me. I got light. It pulls so yellow on me. It looks, it looks bad. Like I look jaundiced. It's, it pulls way too yellow. I don't even know if I can do this like without a sponge. It pulls so yellow on me. It, I can't get away with it. Um, if they had like a light or like a fair cool, I would totally get it and repurchase it. But the plain light, it's way too yellow for me. I can't, it's not my color, which is sad. I tried it so like I tried to get it to work and I just couldn't. This finishing powder I really like. This is not going anywhere. Or setting powder. There's a difference between finishing powder and setting powder, and sometimes I interchangeably use those two words, which I should not do, but it happens. So there you go. Um I don't know. That that no. I'm that that's way too dark for me. That's I don't even know why I have some of these. I'm pretty sure that's expired. There's just no way. I did like this. I don't, I should try to use this up. Like this, I should, I should probably try to use that up. Oh, here's just another translucent one. This one I think is too dark for me if I remember correctly. If I remember correctly. It was like too dark or too yellow. Not that I would normally use this much, but that's why I have a towel. Oh god, that's, yeah. That's not as finely milled as I would prefer, and that's a lot more yellow than I will ever use. Plus, I have that pile of them over there, so, and this one's really old. This predates my channel, so there's that. And then I got this one for free as, like, a freebie, but I don't, it's like the hourglass one, but I is it the translucent veil or is it now I'm covered in powder? Ha ha ha. It's fine. We have to do bronzers. It's not gonna go well. Uh what is this one? Oh, I think it's just the translucent veil. Yeah, this is a mini. I I should I traveled with this last time, but this one's even tinier. So if I have to fly, this is a really good thing to fly with. So I'm gonna keep this to travel with with instructions I appreciate that I need to make sure it doesn't have almond in it but I think we're doing good so I'm keeping four we got rid of four loose powders one two three four five six seven seven foundations one dead concealer and then two like of two of these the cream to powders so I think we did really well because I do have some that are almost empty. These two are almost empty. The hourglass is almost empty. This one's almost empty. So we do have, it, it is gonna go down even more. So I'm okay with that. We're, we're doing, this is good. It's about 50% gone. So I'm happy with that number. And now I'm going to clean up this whole disaster and potentially film I really need to film blushes and highlighters, but I really don't want to do it. Ugh. But stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. And I have a whole mess. Okay, bye.